So let's look at our filters. So first thing we have up here is all results versus products and models. Models are uploaded by four or by by uh, three warehouse members. Products are uploaded by manufacturers. So people putting their own models up here. There are pluses and minuses to both of these. Sometimes products can be very heavy. Sometimes models can be low quality. There's no guarantee that one or the other is going to be a better model, but you do have the ability, if you're looking for like a specific model from a manufacturer, you might want to turn on products rather than just models. Then below that we have categories. So if I came in here and I'm looking for a sofa, I could come down and say, okay, well, I don't, I only want to look in furniture. In fact, subcategory, I want to look at residential furniture. That's going to get any commercial couches out of here. I don't know what a commercial couch is, but they'll be gone. The other thing I look at here are file sizes and polygon count. Polygon counts, again, same thing. I can say here, here's, a, here's what I want to do, or I want to pick one in the middle, or I can come in here and I can use the sliders to say I want a bigger. You do have some options here, for certified content, that is content that has been reviewed and certified, dynamic component, live component, or geolocated. Um, I probably don't want a geolocated sofa in general. I, I want to put it where I want. If you know who made a specific one that you're looking for, you could put that in. Or if you know a specific title, you could look that. Or if you know part of a title, ah, I saw a cool sofa and it was called something, something squishy, comfort, or something like that, you could put that in there. Great, get that. And then the same thing. If you have dates, date modify, if you know any of those additional features because you're looking for a specific thing you've used before, that's there. Visibility, public versus private. Of course, private is going to be private models that you have access to. If it's somebody else's private model, this doesn't give you access to it. This is your private models that you can already get to. Um, and then yeah, as a sp specific filter right there. So then we have some other things we can turn off here uh, that we do or don't want to see. And then I'm going to apply. And you can see that's going to switch. Look, it dropped from over 100,000 down to 200 results. These are the results that fit inside what I was looking for.